It's 3 a.m. You wake up in a panic, shortness of breath, unable to move or speak, covered in sweat, possibly staring at what appears to be a demon in the face as it presses against your chest. Is sleep paralysis really a paranormal occurrence or simply explained by science? Let's dive in to sleep paralysis. Sleep paralysis affects more than 3 million people per year ranging from all ages, 3 to 60, but more common amongst people 14 years or older. With more than 65% of the population experiencing sleep paralysis at least once in their lifetime, and can cause several medical conditions, from slowing your metabolism, insomnia, hallucinations, breathing abnormalities, narcolepsy, and more. Sleep paralysis usually begins for most in their teenage years and will continue through adulthood. Sleep paralysis is usually caused when you awaken from your REM sleep, which is the deepest sleep your body can give you. Your body usually begins to REM sleep around 3 a.m. for most, and is also one of the scientific reasonings behind the witching hour, which I covered in a previous video, link in the description. In order to achieve REM sleep, your body does a few things, like slowing your heart rate, lowering your body temperature, and shuts down as many functions as possible to give you the best sleep. Thus, when you awaken from your REM sleep, your brain and body is not functioning properly, and fear, as well as anxiety, will take over for most. Therefore, you may hallucinate, have shortness of breath, feel chest compressions, be drenched in sweat, and unable to move or speak, resulting in sleep paralysis. Though science has an explanation for sleep paralysis and can be treated by better sleep schedules, more comfort during sleep, as well as sleeping pills and antidepressants, etc., many say there is a paranormal reasoning behind it. Sleep paralysis demons are actually very common belief, though many say it's just an hallucination caused by your brain. You wake up, but your brain is still dreaming, so you see things that aren't really there projecting your nightmares into reality. Others say this demon feeds off of one's dreams, fears, and anxiety, and can even cause horrible nightmares and death as it hovers over you as you sleep. Some see the demon as a shadow figure, while others see it as an actual full-bodied demon with red eyes, sometimes a distorted, monstrous face. But most see it as the old hag. The name Old Hag was given to this demon because many see what is easiest to explain as an old, withered woman, witchy in appearance. She is said to be a malevolent spirit that immobilizes the person as if sitting on their chest or foot of the bed. The Old Hag's roots are said to be European, with Irish folktales and many legends dating back centuries. If you want me to do a deep dive into the history of the Old Hag, leave a comment down below. Whatever form of entity you see, the stories are the same. This presence's main goal is to induce fear and make one suffer as it enjoys your struggle. It returns night after night, feeding off of one's fears, anxiety, and dreams, perhaps trying to achieve the ultimate goal. Death Regardless of whether or not it's paranormal or scientific, sleep paralysis affects a ridiculous number of the population, with both sides agreeing that it is definitely not a pleasant experience by any means. But as with all videos I do like this, leave a comment on what you believe. Is sleep paralysis explained by science and medicine? Or is it really paranormal? If you enjoyed this video, hit that like button. Follow me on TikTok, Instagram, and my Facebook group. And lastly, if you're not already, make sure to hit that subscribe button followed by the notification bell.